Hello and welcome to the Scratch Coding class. In this video, I'm going to explain all the Scratch blocks in seven minutes. And this, I'm going to go over each block very briefly. I'm going to move very fast. If you want more detail, make sure to check out the other videos of the seven minute series. But three, two, one. Let's go. Move ten steps. Going to move steps in a certain direction. Turn degrees. It's going to turn clockwise. Uh, this one turn anti-clockwise. This one goes to a random position or goes to your mouse pointer. This one goes to a certain coordinate. This one glides to a random position or your mouse pointer. This one also glides to a coordinate. This one points in a certain direction. This one points towards a direction again. And then change x by something. It changes the x coordinate by something. Check x so it sets the x coordinate. And it's the same with y. And x is left to right, y is up and down. If on edge point, if it's touching the edge, it will bounce. Set rotation style 2. Left to right, it only rotates left or right. Don't rotate, it doesn't rotate all around, it rotates in a circle. X position, the X position of the sprite, Y position, the Y position of the sprite direction is the direction the sprite is pointing in. Right, next, say hello for, it's just going to say something for a certain amount of time. And this block also says something forever. If it's the same with think, but there's think bubbles, then switch costume too. It switches the costume to the desired costume. Next costume, it switches to the next costume in line. Same with backdrop. Set size and chain size. So set size, chain, set size is a percentage and chain size changes the percentage. And then change color effect by it just changes your effect set. Color effect 2, it sets your effect. Clear graphic effects, it's going to clear all the effects. Show, you can see it's right. Hide, you can't see the sprite. Go to front there, that means it's in front of other sprites, so you can see it first. Go forward there, again, similar thing, you go forward so you can see see it more than another sprite. Costume number, costume name, and then backdrop number, and your backdrop name, and then size is how big the sprite is. Right, sound, play sound meow until I'm done, it's just going to play a sound until it's done. Start sound, it's just going to start the sound, similar thing. Stop all sound, it's going to stop. All the sounds are playing. Change effect by pitch effect is how high new the note is. And pan left to right is shifting the output of the audio track. So, so you can set the effect as well. And then clear sound effects is going to clear all the effects. Change volume by it's just going to change the volume. Set volume to it's just going to set the volume. Volume is basically how noisy it is. Right. We're moving on into events. When green flag click, something will happen if the green flag is clicked. When key is pressed. When one of the keys is pressed, when the sprite click, when you click on the sprite, then backdrop switches to when the backdrop switches to the backdrop. And then noidness is greater than 10, it's how loud it is, how loud I'm speaking into the microphone. And when I receive message 1 is when I get the message, broadcast message 1, I'm going to broadcast the message and broadcast message 1 and wait. Which means I'm going to broadcast it and then wait for a while. Right, control. Wait seconds, it's going to wait for a certain number of seconds. Repeat, it's going to repeat for a certain number of times. Forever, it's going to repeat forever. If, then, it's going to do something if the condition is true. If, then, else, if it's going to do something if the condition is true or if it's false. And then, wait until, it's going to wait until something happens there. Wait, repeat until, it's going to repeat until something happens there. And then, it says, stop all. You stop everything. This script it stops the script. Other scripts and sprite it stops other scripts in the sprite. When I start as clone, it's when it is a clone. It's for clones. And then create clone of myself. It's gonna create a clone and delete the clone. It deletes the clone. Right, sensing touching mouse pointer. If it's touching the mouse or if it's touching the edge, touching color. If it's touching a color, color is touching that. So if a color is touching another color. Distance to mouse pointer is just how far it is from the mouse pointer to the sprite. Ask what's your name and wait is going to ask a question and the user can input an answer which is this block. Key, something pressed if a key is pressed. Mouse down if you're holding down the mouse. Mouse X, the X coordinates of the mouse. Mouse Y, the Y coordinates of the mouse. Set drag mode to draggable. You can drag the sprite about. You can move it with the mouse. And then Noidness is how noid I'm speaking to the microphone. Timer, when you start any script, the timer is zero and it just keeps ticking up. Reset timer, it sets the timer to zero. Backdrop number of stage, it, the backdrop number or the backdrop name of the stage or volume or, or my variable, which we will get into. Current year, what year it is, and you can obviously change it to month and all, but I'm not going to go over it. Day since 2000, how many days it is since the year 2000, and username, it's online scratch, 
the username of people using your project. Right, next, operators adds two values, subtracts two values, multiplies two values, divides two values, chooses a, a random value between a range greater than, less than, and then this is equal to, and if two things are both true, or if one of the two things are true, not, if none of them are true, join Apple Finance, joins string consultation, and netter of Apple is going to say the first or second letter of Apple, and then length of Apple is how many characters are in it, Apple contains, uh, if a word contains a certain letter, mod is the remainder when you divide round, it rounds to the nearest whole number, and abs of, you can change it to a mathematical function. Right, variables, a variable is a sort of data set variable is set to a variable to a certain value changes it, it increases or decreases it by a certain value show variable you can see it high variable you can't see it right nists add thing to list is basically it just adds a, an object to the list delete it's just going to delete the item and then delete all it's going to delete the whole list insert thing at it's going to insert a thing it's going to insert your thing you want to put in the nist at a certain item number and then it's going to replace the item with this block this is the item and then this is the item number and then this is the length of numbers if the number contains something and numbers is my list of course show nest or hide nest right my blocks you can basically choose a block like that and then this defines the block it's like a function in scratch right so music i'm going to quickly do this we're nearly out of time play drum it's going to play a drum for a certain number of beats rest it's not going to play anything play note it's going to play note on the piano and you can obviously change that instrument tempo is how fast it is and you can change the tempo or set it and this is the tempo and we have 10 seconds left and i think i have explained everything on scratch in just seven minutes we're going to wait for the timer to end yes there we go okay i'm going to slow down talking now that was very difficult it was very intense i wanted to get everything done and we just did that so that's all of the blocks and scratch explained in seven minutes i hope this seven minute series has helped you this is of course the final video of it so i'm sorry to say that's gonna go so now leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and check out all my other coding videos and i will see you soon Bye bye